is your first alert five weather with Jessica Van Meter. Well, welcome back. We're off to a cloudy start around our area and around the Denver metro area. And of course, the Broncos are going to be in town later on today. They're taking on the Seahawks this afternoon. We are going to see a little bit of improvement in the skies by the time we get to kickoff and the game, but temperatures are going to be very warm well into the mid 80s through much of the game. We'll see a little more sunshine than we've got up there in Denver so far this morning. Now across our area, you've got a lot of low level cloud cover and some higher clouds that are actually showing up on the satellite right now, showing just a couple returns on radar, maybe just a light shower, if anything, reaching the surface with those. We are going to see a good deal more cloud cover today than we did yesterday. Not quite as much clearing heading our way. Once we do get rid of that low level cloud cover and a few isolated areas of fog this morning, still I think we'll see at least a little bit of sunshine in the mix through the late morning and early afternoon hours. Some additional cloud cover and a chance for a stray shower or thunderstorm heading our way through the second half of the day. Temperatures will be a little warmer than yesterday in the 70s to low 80s for those higher elevation areas of Teller, northern El Paso County into the low to mid 80s around the Colorado Springs area down towards Pueblo, getting into the upper 80s around town, a little cooler off to the west across some of those higher elevation areas, especially out towards areas of the plains. We're also getting into the 80s for our highs. Now after today, we're going to see a pattern change heading our way. Our flow has generally been coming from the northwest and the west, so it's been pulling in some moisture, giving us a few of those disturbances to pop up those PM shower and thunderstorm chances. After today, though, those winds are going to shift around to the southwest, and that's where they'll stay for the rest of the week. That's going to be pulling in some hot, dry air from the desert southwest. That monsoon moisture's kind of been cut off for right now. So with that southwest flow, it's going to mean hot, dry conditions are heading our way. 80s for today, mid 80s around Colorado Springs tomorrow, and then upper 80s, close to 90 for the rest of the week. Today, our only chance for a stray PM shower or thunderstorm, just about a 10% chance there. Otherwise, we're dry, sunny, and hot for the rest of the week. Pueblo in the upper 80s for today, small chance for a stray shower hour or thunderstorm after today. Sunny, hot, temperatures getting into the 90s, even mid 90s on some of our warmest days. Canyon City in the 80s for the next few days. Small chance to that stray shower or thunderstorm today. Aside from that, dry, sunny and hot, even close to 90 through the middle of the week. With the park and the higher elevation areas, generally in the 70s, you'll see that chance for a stray shower or storm later on today. And then after that, we're looking dry, sunshine, temperatures close to 80 by later this week. You know, we really can't complain. You know, it's technically